Top 13 Foods for Strong Blood Flow After 50 Let's talk about something vital for your health, blood flow. It's a big deal because it makes sure all parts of your body get the oxygen and nutrients they need to keep going strong. But as we get older, our blood flow might slow down a bit, and that could cause some serious health problems. But don't worry, there's good news. You can boost your blood flow and promote overall wellness with some tasty foods. Yep, you heard me right, what you eat matters. So let's dive into the delicious world of foods that can help maintain healthy circulation. Number 1. Garlic Now, I know what you might be thinking, garlic? Really? But stick with me here because there's some science behind it. There have been studies that suggest that garlic can help improve blood flow. One study published in the Journal of Current Medical Research and Opinion found that garlic can enhance nitric oxide production in the body. Nitric oxide is like the magic potion for your blood vessels. It helps them relax and widen, which means better blood flow. Another study from the Journal of Experimental and Therapeutic Medicine showed that garlic might also help lower blood pressure. When your blood pressure is in a good range, your blood vessels are under less stress, and that's a good thing for keeping them healthy and flexible. Also, adding it to your diet is super easy. You can chop it up and toss it into your favorite dishes. Soups, stews, stir-fries, you name it. Or if you're feeling adventurous, you can even roast a whole head of garlic and spread that soft, caramelized goodness on some toast. Number 2. Beets These bright and colorful root veggies are not just pretty, they're fantastic for boosting blood flow. Beets are loaded with nitrates, which your body turns into nitric oxide. Yep, that magic stuff again. And you already know nitric oxide is the VIP that helps your blood vessels relax and widen, keeping that blood flowing smoothly. They are also rich in antioxidants like beta-lanes and vitamin C, which reduce oxidative stress and inflammation in blood vessels. By neutralizing harmful free radicals, antioxidants maintain the health and elasticity of blood vessels, preventing age-related damage. So you want to know how to bring beets into your diet? You can either juice those beets solo or mix them with other fruits and veggies for a yummy and nutritious drink. And if tangy is your thing, pickled beets are the bomb. They're perfect for sandwiches, wraps, or having a party with some fancy cheese. Number 3. Green Tea Green tea is loaded with these awesome things called catechins. These have some serious antioxidant powers, which means they can fight free radicals in your body. Free radicals are like little troublemakers that can damage your cells, including the ones in your blood vessels. Also, a study published in the journal Scientific Reports found that regular green tea consumption improved endothelial function. Don't let the fancy term scare you off. All it means is that the cells lining your blood vessels are happier and healthier thanks to green tea. So how much green tea should you have to get these benefits? Keep it cool and enjoy a cup or two daily. That's the sweet spot for awesome results. But remember, don't load it up with sugar or other sweeteners. That could offset some of the positive effects. Number 4. Leafy Greens Leafy greens have this awesome thing called potassium. It's not as famous as calcium or iron, but it does some important work. A study published in the Journal of Advances in Nutrition found that potassium-rich foods, such as leafy greens, could effectively contribute to the management of hypertension and overall cardiovascular health. Potassium relaxes your blood vessels, which means they don't get all constricted and make your heart work harder. Then we have nutrients like vitamin K and folate. Vitamin K is like the handyman that helps your body form blood clots, so when you get a cut, it helps your blood clot and prevents excessive bleeding. Folate, on the other hand, is responsible for creating more red blood cells. These cells carry oxygen throughout your body, promoting better circulation. Number 5. Nuts and Seeds Nuts like almonds, walnuts, and pistachios are full of good-for-you fats, like omega-3 fatty acids. They reduce bad cholesterol levels and inflammation. And guess what? That means less gunk building up in your arteries and a clear path for better blood flow. Now let's talk about seeds, like chia seeds and flax seeds. These tiny powerhouses are loaded with fiber, which is fantastic for your heart and blood vessels. Fiber prevents cholesterol from hanging around in your bloodstream, so it's kind of like a scrubber, making sure your arteries stay clear and open for business. 
Nuts and seeds also contain some pretty cool minerals like potassium and magnesium. They play an important role in regulating your blood pressure. Now, I'm not saying you should go nuts and eat tons of them all at once. Moderation is key. Stick to a handful of nuts and seeds as a snack or in your dishes for maximum effect. Number 6. Dark Chocolate Dark chocolate can actually be good for your blood flow. Now, don't go reaching for a candy bar just yet. We're talking about dark chocolate with a high cocoa content, at least 70% or more. This type of chocolate is packed with flavonoids, which are powerful antioxidants. Flavonoids have been shown to improve blood flow, relax blood vessels, and reduce inflammation. One study published in the journal Acta Medica Indonesiana found that dark chocolate consumption improved blood flow in participants and increased their levels of nitric oxide. Now, this doesn't mean you should go overboard on dark chocolate, as it still contains calories and sugar. But incorporating a small piece as an occasional treat can be a delightful way to support your blood flow. We've made it halfway through our list, and we sincerely hope you've enjoyed it so far. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Hit the like button and ring the notification bell if you want to see more content like this. Let's move forward with the video. Number 7. Berries Berries, like blueberries, strawberries, and raspberries, are like a tasty team of blood flow boosters. They're packed with antioxidants, which play a crucial role in supporting cardiovascular health. One study published in the Journal of the Academy of Nutrition and Dietetics found that consuming blueberries daily improved blood vessel function and reduced arterial stiffness. Another study reported that a single serving of strawberries increased blood flow and reduced oxidative stress in overweight adults. Oxidative stress is like a state of imbalance in our body, where there's an excess of free radicals causing damage to our cells, including the ones in our blood vessels. And remember those flavonoids we talked about earlier? Yup, berries have them in spades. Flavonoids boost nitric oxide levels in our body, which means our blood vessels can chill out and expand, leading to better blood flow. Number 8. Whole Grains Unlike refined grains, which have their outer layers stripped away, whole grains keep everything intact, the bran, the germ, and the endosperm, and that's where all the goodness lies. One of the key players in whole grains is fiber. Think of fiber as a friendly broom that sweeps away the bad stuff in our blood vessels, keeping them clear and smooth for the blood to flow without any hurdles. Also, whole grains have a way lower glycemic index than refined ones. What does that mean? Well, it means they release sugar into our bloodstream at a steady pace, keeping our blood sugar levels stable. Stable blood sugar levels support healthy blood flow, as there are no sudden spikes or crashes to throw things off balance. So how can you add more whole grains to your life? Easy! Swap out refined grains like white rice and white bread with their whole grain counterparts. Brown rice, whole wheat bread, quinoa, and oats are all great choices. You can also explore delicious options like bulgur, farro, and barley to mix things up. Number 9. Oranges One of the major players in oranges that boost blood flow is vitamin C. Yep, that's the same vitamin C you hear about when you feel a cold coming on. But it's not just for sniffles. It's a rock star for our blood vessels, too. Vitamin C is like a repair crew for our blood vessels. It keeps them strong and flexible so they can do their job of transporting blood smoothly and efficiently. A study published in the Journal of Atherosclerosis found that vitamin C intake is associated with better endothelial function. Endothelial function refers to how well our blood vessels function, and how well they can dilate and constrict to regulate blood flow. But as always, it's about balance. Don't go overboard with orange juice or sugary orange-flavored treats. The real magic lies in enjoying whole, fresh oranges and incorporating them into a well-rounded diet. Number 10. Greek Yogurt So, Greek yogurt is like regular yogurt's supercharged cousin. It's thicker, creamier, and packs a serious punch of nutrients. One of the star players in Greek yogurt is calcium. You know, the stuff that's usually linked to strong bones? Well, it's not just bones that benefit from calcium. Your blood vessels do too. Calcium helps those blood highways stay relaxed and flexible, promoting smooth and efficient blood flow. Now let's talk about the gut game. Greek yogurt is packed with probiotics, those friendly little bacteria that party in your gut. 
They might be tiny, but they pack a punch when it comes to keeping your gut happy and healthy. But here's the twist. A happy gut means happy blood vessels too. A study published in Oxidative Medicine and Cellular Longevity found that probiotic-rich foods, like Greek yogurt, improve endothelial function and blood circulation. Number 11. Cinnamon A study published in the Avicenna Journal of Phytomedicine found that consuming just a teaspoon of cinnamon can have a positive effect on blood flow, especially in people over 50. The researchers observed improvements in blood flow velocity and overall circulation in those who incorporated cinnamon into their diet. How does it work? Well, it contains compounds like cinnamaldehyde and cinnamic acid, which relax those blood vessels, making them more flexible and improving the blood flow throughout your body. Now, before you go overboard and start sprinkling cinnamon on everything you eat, remember that moderation is key. A little goes a long way, and adding a teaspoon to your daily routine should do the trick. You can sprinkle it on your morning oatmeal, mix it into smoothies, or even add it to savory dishes like stews for a delightful twist. Number 12. Olive Oil Olive oil is loaded with heart-healthy monounsaturated fats, which your blood vessels absolutely adore. These fats keep your arteries clear and flexible, allowing blood to flow smoothly without any traffic jams. But wait, there's more to the olive oil story! It's also packed with powerful antioxidants called polyphenols. By giving your blood vessels a shield of protection, polyphenols ensure they stay healthy and happy, promoting better blood flow. And here's the scientific backup. Researchers published a study in the Frontiers in Cardiovascular Medicine, and guess what they found? People who incorporated extra virgin olive oil into their diets had improved endothelial function. And now we all know, the better the endothelial function, the happier your blood vessels, and the smoother your circulation. Number 13. Water It might not be as exciting as some of the other foods on this list, but it's one of the most essential for maintaining healthy blood flow. Hydration is key for all aspects of your health, and your circulation is no exception. When you're well hydrated, your blood becomes more fluid and easier to pump through your vessels, whereas dehydration can lead to thicker blood, making it harder for your heart to circulate effectively. But that's not all water does for your blood flow. It also transports nutrients and oxygen throughout your body, keeping all your cells happy and functioning optimally. Plus, it aids in flushing out waste and toxins, which can otherwise accumulate and impede circulation. Now you might be asking yourself, what's the right amount of water for me? Well, the 8 glasses a day rule is a decent guideline, but the actual amount varies depending on factors like your age, activity level, climate, and overall health. Just go with the flow and drink up when your body tells you it's thirsty. And if you're more active or in a hot climate, you might need to increase your intake to stay properly hydrated. So go ahead! Fill your plate with these amazing foods, and keep that blood flow strong like a boss. Your body will thank you, and you'll be rocking the road to a healthier and happier you. Cheers to good health and happy eating! Do you find this video informative or helpful? Let us know in the comments section below. Make sure to subscribe so you don't miss out on my future videos. Don't forget to like and share. Stay healthy!